everybody, welcome back to Just Family Adventures. I'm Lauren. I'm Gwen. And today we have another big haul for you. We found ourselves uh -oh. Not in trouble on release day, which was this past Tuesday, March. There was a lot of releases this week. You know? Yes. <laughs> oh, Lily, cool. Lily Pelsner. Pelsner. And the Mickey's Main Attraction finally dropped. And then Disney Vera Bradley released a oh, massive Little, Little Mermaid. Mermaid. Which we knew we were in trouble. So they give you this when you're standing in line waiting for the store to open. I guess so you can pre-shop so you're not in there forever. But the only problem with this, even though there's a bunch of items, it wasn't everything in wasn't the store. There. Well, no. There was other items in the store oh, that yeah, aren't yeah, on the items. list, and then stuff on this list wasn't in the store. So, I mean, it's helpful, but it's not. And I didn't really look at it because I was like, I didn't buy anything, Little Mermaid. Yeah, and don't mind my appearance today. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, we're going to the beach tomorrow, so I needed to film this so and I can use it. Minute. So, we spent a pretty penny, but I'm not mad. So, we'll start with the <laughs> cheapest <laughs> item first. This was um, $15. We have the reusable tote bag, which I really like their bags. <laughs> Even though they give you, as their shopping bag, when you check out, they give you the reusable tote. But this has the pocket on the inside. It's, it's large. And then the inside, that is the pattern for this print. So you have Seb Sebastian Flounder and then the Under the Sea Band. And then you have Ariel and Flounder. Well, this is just Ariel, but you have, this is kind of the other print that they went with. So this was $15. This will come in handy, you know, because we carry reusable tip bags. We had so, to, we had to in Delaware because I stopped flashing bags, but that's not the case here. Should I go and order a price? Did I, I said that was good. I don't know. Because then it might get too much. Yeah. Okay. So the next thing that I have, this was $25. So we're not going in order of prices. I'm just going to, It's we have the tumbler. I was going to just take this off because this is going to be my new, my new drink vessel. <laughs> is that what they're called? He walks away. So this is $25, comes with the straw in the plastic bag, which is nice, but it's a bendable straw. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, so it won't break. It is 24 ounces, but it's not glittery, but I'm sure you could drill a hole in it and do the whole water globe, snow globe thing that people do with the epoxy, is it called? Which, that would be a fun experiment, but I don't know. And it does say, do not microwave, and then hand wash only. But I love the color they went with this. And we, I know we should have filmed in the store, but it was, it's in crowded, so it's hard to, yeah, and it's not a that's, big store. And it's a small store. And so. we were number 26 in line, so I counted. <laughs> so I had to do that. I <laughs> so yeah. And then going into the store, although we had Richie because it was spring break and, um, you got a free button, but they didn't give Richie a button, which was sad. He should have said, I will have the little mermaid. <laughs> yeah, we didn't think of it at the time. And there was just... an entry you could win, um, but there were, they gave you no details. Yeah. It was just a sign because I went up to look to see. I mean, I don't know, maybe one, if you purchase, that puts you in the drawing for it. But it was different than Beauty and the Beast because Beauty and the Beast, they opened earlier. Mm -hmm. They opened an hour earlier than normal. And they gave you, I guess we got the button. 
But we they, got a rose. Yeah, they get, And then you got a little something with a number. No, depending you pull you pick the ro a rose out of like a container oh, and, and then the color, color of the, the stem. Bottom. Um you yeah, got you a, a prize. Free, yeah. And I got a lanyard out of it, which was we a fifteen dollar value. We both got the same thing. Where we just got Button. A button. But at least it has Little Mermaid because the prize for the Beauty and the Beast didn't have anything to do with. Well, it was a rose. I know, but the actual, like, gift. Because it was. Yeah, because the lanyard wasn't Beauty and the Beast. I was going to get the lanyard, but then I decided not to because I don't really use lanyards anymore. Um, So I picked up the ID. Which I thought wallet. you weren't going to use it anymore. These? I use that all the time. I know, but, I I know, but you said since it's discolored, an ID of yours. See, from it discolored, high uh, no, middle school. It was my tele middle school ID thing. But that was also a red color, and it wasn't like a state issued ID that has like all the mm -hmm. special stuff. Uh, I think it maybe because the way it was printed. Okay. But who knows what I had done with that? Like, it could have been out in the sun, you know, like. This thing stays in my purse. It has all my annual passes in it. But, so I have one with my Hogwarts. So when we go to Universal, I have that one. And I have this one because the one I have now is Disney. It's a Vera Bradley one. But it's starting to like wear at the corner. So a hole's coming soon. <laughs> And then I got this because I just really liked it. This was $25. A bit pricey for a keychain. Well, it's called a bag charm. But, you know me, I think the shelf. I'm not going to use it as a keychain. It's going to get all dirty. And the lanyard's shaped like a shelf. The keychain. Well, the, the piece that actually... Yeah. The uh, ring. You got flounder. But I like that. That's a good pose. Yeah, they did her well. I will say that. And then the next thing that I had to have, which now I need to get a phone case to put it on. <laughs> I got a pop socket. <laughs> I had to buy everything. It's my favorite princess ever. And this one was $19.99. Normally their prices are even numbers, but I guess when they are collab with a different company is when they add... But that's the only one that was like that. Mm -mm. These two. Oh. So then I'm just going to show them because I'm talking about them. They had Crocs, which weren't on the list. They had the flip flops on here, but not the Crocs. And these were $54.99. Cheaper than. Yeah. A Disney. super good price. Disney, yeah. Mm -hmm. And it does say copyright like Disney Vera Bradley Croc on the inside. So it's like three mashups in one. So, I love them. I so go on to the beach tomorrow. Yes! I'm going to be decked out. I'm going to look crazy. <laughs> you <laughs> be like He that. just needed a beer, Riley, we'll Little We'll get you a uh, Little suit. Mermaid inner tube and you can be walking to the beach. I had one when she was little. She well, the bathing suit that I did buy, which I splurged, I bought a, a Lily Pizer bathing suit for $154 because I'm crazy. It kind of matches. <laughs> Not really. It's going to clash. But then I got this beach towel for the beach tomorrow. I'm super excited about this. I need to wash it. It's all like fuzzy before we go. Well, but you it has. Never get washed I know. I'm doing the wash now. But it has like. Where was it? There's seahorses on it. Yeah. Little seahorses, Ariel, the turtle. turtle. It's super thick, terry cloth on the other side. I really like it. This was a bit pricey for a towel. This was $50. So, but well worth it. Because it's like, let me see. It's a true beach towel. It's as tall as you. Yeah, it it's is. Crying. It's touching the floor. Six foot. Yeah, so I wonder if it says on the tag how the dimensions. Does it say on here? No, it doesn't say. Okay, so that's it for the first bag. 
first bag. We got like four bags. Then my big splurge. I bought this $75 bag, which is called, is it on there? Mm. Yeah, it is. The reactive, no. no, this isn't drawstring, but that looks like it. Yeah, this is called the re reactive drawstring family tote, but there's no drawstring. Oh, there is a drawstring. Oh, <gasps> that's cute. So, well, so you don't have to worry about your all your stuff falling out. So there's a drawstring. So this is my beach bag and it says that, where's the tag? Oh, here it is. That this is made from recycled plastic bottles. 16 recycled plastic bottles, one yard of fabric. It's water, it's recycled plastic, water repellent fabric, durable and lightweight, which it is, it's not heavy. But the whole inside is lined with like waterproof, like. Oh. I really wanted that myself because I love a good beach bag, and I can't find my beach but bag. But I don't, so I don't have a beach bag. And then there's one like regular pocket right here, and then you have this zip pocket in the front. Has the waterproof on the outside, fabric on the inside. It's very large. It will hold all my stuff. Our change of clothes, because typically I bring a backpack to the beach. But then I worry about it like getting in the sand where this, no issues. Um, that's, yeah. This is why I wanted to go to the beach tomorrow. <laughs> Just so she, she yes. As soon as she had that, oh it was God. like, we're going to the beach this weekend. <laughs> Somebody who doesn't even like the beach. But now I have all this stuff for the beach. And bought a, almost $200 beach. She'll be going to the beach every no, I ain't trying to do the picture with oh, yeah, gas right. prices. Yeah, that's why. Like, but, once a month. Well, they have dropped. Yeah, and they actually did come down. But that's another thing I was thinking. You sold our beach buggy. Like, why did you do that? We were coming to Florida where we were surrounded oh, by beaches. Oh, well, it's okay. We'll get that mini mouse one. It's not a beach buggy. <laughs> the next thing I have is, they didn't have this in the store. We had to order this one. But it arrived. Um is the blanket i don't want to open this one yet this one was 65 dollars, but that is what it looks like right there the plush throw so you have ariel and flat i was gonna yeah. say sebastian F founder and flounder. some fish you got some to... oh you do have sebastian on there oh okay oh yeah at the very top okay yeah, you can see him right there that's a different one. Oh. So, I just realized she's in two different poses on this cup. Um, I did get the second blanket, which will open this one. This Again, these were $65. The They're, second is the other pattern? Yeah, mm -hmm. I was going to open it. Well, you can open it. These are 80 by 50, which is 10... 10 inches smaller than a queen size bed. I love these. My mom's like, you don't use blankets, but my Mrs. Potts one, I use, I sleep with that every night. So like now I can finally watch it. <laughs> I don't want to know. <laughs> and Gosh, then, I can't even sleep with any blankets on. Well, well I use this instead of a comforter. But yeah, this is a blanket. I love these. They're so soft. They're lightweight. And they're Disney, and this one's Little Mermaid. I love it so much. But yeah, you have all the... It's probably such bad. We're not trying it very well. But, I love it. Don't break my blanket. What else do we have? I mean, that's it. That's it? Yeah, that's all my stuff. Okay, so it's my turn. That's not the other thing. So I first wasn't going to, as I said, wasn't going to get anything because I'm not Little Mermaid. But then I saw this little oh god, you love, phone case. You love dead things. <laughs> so I got this for the beach, or for the pool, wherever. To put a phone in. And, and I, I saw a guy playing with it and still has fingerprints all over it. Um, 
That was thirty-two dollars. He was. He, you can actually take pictures and everything through it. Yeah, you can touch like you can I didn't use know it. That. And then the next thing I bought was this thing in my bob, and it's for um. They're really dirty. Um. I mean, if they're a brand new thing, and I what? I always usually pick one from the back, but um, it's for your sun paint lotion. Because I always put everything in this black bag. I was going to say, did you test it? See if your phone fit in it? Mm -hmm. It's a tight squeeze. And then the last thing I got, and I thought for the beach, um, even though I do like the big tote, but of course I wasn't going to spend that kind of money, but was the drawstring bag. It has... Pockets. So this does work, but just a little FYI, if you do get it, you have to press kind of hard. But that's cool that you can like use your phone. Still use your phone. Because this would be good for water parks. Yeah. Um, this really opens up, and you have some nice pockets in there. What one was this called? What? The drawstring. Yeah, because this one's also made with recycled, recycled. material. This one was called the Reactive Deluxe Drawstring Backpack. And then there's this one zipper. And this is kind of what I usually use as my bag. On, I mean, I usually take a big tote that I keep my the towels in and like the suntan lotion. I would always take like a bag like this to keep my, like a book, bag, you know, if I'd go on the beach. Yeah. I always the read magazines. And the, um, so, yeah. But now you have this for all your suntan lotion. Yep. <laughs> and you talk about me, and she's buying all this, but I, I... I bought three things. I allow this, because it's little. Well, you were the one who was like, oh, what about this? <laughs> but, no, that's not true, because when we walked in the store, we went separate ways and then met up, and she had all this stuff in her hands. No, <laughs> you pointed it out when we were standing there. Yeah, line. I did. On here, but... I didn't. Say I that. um. Did you say that was forty dollars? No. And then the drawstring backpack was sixty-five. So I wasn't the only one to spend money. But um, yeah. So we'll try them out tomorrow. See how they. It's like work. I kind of wish I would have got the notebook. I did really like the tote bag. But it was $150. And we did pick up the backpack, but that's for somebody. So if there's anything on here you would like us to get as long as they still have it available. Yes. We, we will, can get that for you. We can maybe do a better close-up of that. Or... Yeah, it is on our Instagram. This family underscore ventures underscore pickups we'll leave that down below i did post that we were in line waiting for this with a picture of that even though like i said not everything was in the store and they had more than what was on here because they had a mini backpack that wasn't on this list in the store i yeah. didn't even really look that much i only kind of there was so many when people. did this stuff release tuesday okay because i'm going to try to post this Tomorrow, not tomorrow, Sunday. Sunday, Sunday yeah, that'll be good. Um, yeah, and they even have like clothing, which I don't typically see. Yeah, a lot of people were buying their shorts. Yeah. They well, were soft. Cute. They were pajama shorts, pajama pants. They had pants, shorts, and a short sleeve shirt and a pair of socks. I didn't see the pillow. They must not have had that. One, it was, I think it was that. That was really tiny. Was that the one? The little chest? No. Maybe it was that. I don't know. I thought it was a chest. That reminds me of like a AirPod container. So we hope you enjoyed our Vera Bradley haul. So please give us a thumbs up. It really helps our channel out. Comment um, what was your favorite. Did you pick any of this up? I think my favorite was the Crocs. Yeah, I did see good. there's gibbets coming soon, so I'm going to be on the lookout for those. I need mm. me some of those. <laughs> and if you're new, please subscribe, and we'll see, see you in the, the next, next one. one. Bye! Bye.